in this lab i will show how to capture the packets using the wire shaft so for this lab to conduct this lab you need two machines one is kali or parrot another one is metasploitable 2 so i put both the machines okay in the bridged adapter but already i have told you in the lab <coughs> uh, in, in, in inside the college if you are using your personal computer then go for the NAT network <coughs> then note down the IP address the IP of the metasploitable is 1.16 and the IP of the Kali let's see what is IP of the Kali go here terminal emulator okay plus plus if config 1.15 so just check whether you are able to ping uh, this yes you are able to ping okay so now let me show you how to access a service called FTP in the metasploitable so FTP okay so IP address of the machine 192.168.1.16 so this is the this is the Now let me repeat that again. This asking the username FTP space IP address of the metasploitable 2. So MSF admin is the username, password same MSF admin. Okay, so now if you see you are in the metasploitable 2 framework, so this service is called FTP file transfer protocol it is used to transfer the files from your system to the remote system also you can download the files the main uh, objective of this lab is to capture the credentials username and password when from your local computer if you try to connect with the uh, FTP server remote system which is running in a remote system the communication is plain text there is no encryption for the FTP protocol so easily the hackers can uh, capture the username and password how they do that that is what we are going to see okay so now you will see how I do that so go here and run a tool called uh, sniffing Wireshark so this tool is called Wireshark okay so this is the wire shot and here is your terminal so here keep the command ready keep the command don't uh, um, enter press the enter button just keep the uh, command ready then go to the wire shot okay so this is the wire shot then go to capture then click start so then what you do you go to the this FTP then type MSF admin and then MSF admin now the FTP uh, login process is successful then you go to the wire shot stop this is stop and then you have to find whether the wire shark has captured your username and password so just go here you have to filter the packets FTP and then click here so all the FTP data are here so you can see here the username is MSF at me okay then the password you can see the password is MSF at me Understand. So now we have captured the username and password successfully using the wire shot. 
because the FTP communication is not secure. So since the FTP communication is not secure, uh, using the tools like Wireshark, you can capture the packet and see the username and password. So this is the lab three. Okay. So I wish you uh, see this video and complete. Okay, in your system.